Hi guys and welcome to my makeup time to get Ellis here and today I'm gonna be filming a makeup collection. So a lot of you guys have requested a makeup collection and I got you. I got you. We're gonna film a makeup collection today. We're gonna go into that van. We're gonna go into them drawers and we're gonna see what all kind of makeup I got. So it's been two whole years and I feel bad for not having to have made one. So yeah, we're gonna make one right now. Let's dive right in. Oh wait, 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 wait. Um, before I start, I'm not trying to brag. I have a job. I buy a lot of makeup myself. Christmas, birthdays, I get makeup. So yeah, hope y'all enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Let's go. So this is my makeup collection from afar. That's my Vandy and that's the little thing from like, Jesus, three years ago. Okay, I used to put in that, but it outgrew that. Okay. When I bought that, I was having minimalistic thoughts. But then, I just went optimistic. And I just bought a lot of makeup. So, we're going to go into it. I'm going to sit down because it's more stable. This is the top of my vanity. Um, Right here, I have... I'm just going to start over here, okay? So, right here, I have my um two cups from Target. And the first one just has all my eye brushes. Okay, all my brushes are dirty. So just disregard it. So all my eye brushes and then the flat colors. Oh, good miracle. Not. Okay, then all my face brushes. All my brushes. Pretty much real techniques. Wet and wild. Um, coastal scents. Profusion. Not profusion. I don't know. Just a lot of cheap makeup brushes, but like good makeup brushes. So yeah. And then here I have my picture of me and my mom on my mirror. Now my chorus box because I use it when I do my get ready with me's. And then this is my file organizer that I also used like a whole while ago. But I just took it back out to put all my favorite palettes in it. These are my most used palettes. Must have palettes. And I could not live with all these. Wait. I could not live without all these. So yeah. So the first one is my MAC palette. I finally finished my MAC palette. If you want me to do a video on it, I will. I have a MAC like little palette. And then I have my Tarte Magnificent palette. I have my favorite contour thing. This is the Black Radiance True Complexion Contour Palette. Look at that. And all three of my favorite eyeshadow palettes. The Modern Renaissance, Chocolate Bummers, and then the um, Sweet Peach palette. Here is a whole bunch of skincare, body care, random stuff. So... The first thing over here is some oil because my body is dry. So, you know, oil. And then I have deodorant. I have some alcohol because, yes, look at that dry window. Um, I have moisturizer. This is my favorite one ever. I have this moisturizer, which is like, I don't know, I use this as a like itch cream. Because you know if you get bit by something, it itches a lot. Well, I don't like to itch my stuff. So I just use this stuff. And then, here is some doggone Christmas lotion in this May. I have some vitamins here that I have yet to take. I need to actually get on that. And then this card, my friend Maya gave me when I did her prom makeup. And it's really pretty. And cute and it's springy. So, I kept it on my mani. Now, we get into the inside of the madness. So, over here, I have a bag. I don't know why. I forgot what was in it. But I have a bag. And then, like, all my hair ties. All my hair rollers are back here. And then, these are some lashes. And some more hair ties. But, like, thinner. And a cream eyeshadow. Because why not? So, right here, I have my Naked 2 palette. Because it's really fragile. And it can't, like, lay up like these. So yeah, and then I have some drugstore palettes from CoverGirl Maybelline here as well as a huge highlighter that doesn't fit anywhere else. And like some random stuff here. So these three containers are from Target and these like white ones are from Wally Well. So back here I have all my single eyeshadows from ColourPop. I have two from MAC because they're like almost done. Two from like Shop Miss A um, and two from Urban Decay and one from L'Oreal. Here is all my brow stuff. So I have like my definer, my e.l.f. brow pencil, DIY brow pomade, a whole bunch of more brow pencils from like NYX and LA Colors, my favorite brow gels, 
right here. And then this one from Shop Miss A, which actually sucks. And then all my brow kits from Wet n Wild Elf and all them back down. Here's all my mascara. All of my drugstore is sipped for these two because, you know, Sephora and free, you know? Um, and then we have my favorite section in this little part, which is my glitter. So this is like some Halloween glitter for Walmart. These come from Shop Miss A. They're glitter liners that I use as glitter adhesives. And then this is my Urban Decay um, Amp glitter liner. It's so pretty for the summertime and springtime glitter pots right here that are really super cool for are from book glitters and then i have a jesse's girl glitter and some beauty treats glitters yay glitter cool oh i feel like i'm talking 100 miles per hour so now we're gonna get on top okay let me sit up on my knees now we're gonna get on top of this thing so right here i have some pearls because why not why not just throw your pearls right there and then this is a NYX eyeshadow pencil, but I cannot put it in the drawer because I lost the top. So I just keep it out. This is my makeup bag from Victoria's Secret. And in here is all my everyday makeup. And then these two acrylic containers, one's from TJ Maxx, one's from uh, the container store. So I just have some tweezers on the side of this little one. And then all my like luxury lipstick, so all my... Urban K and Matt. Okay, that's not that luxury, but it's like high price. So it's luxury to me, you know? And then I have a pot Carmex. Because a pot Carmex. It's my sister's, actually. And then back here, I have more lipsticks. So these are like my really super colorful lipsticks for the spring. And my favorite two lipsticks of all time from Smashbox. I love these two lipsticks. They have completely erased every other lipstick. And these are my favorite, you know? My two favorite lipsticks of all time. It's the colors Dream Huge and Stepping Out by Smashbox. I love these. They're so good. Get you some. They're really expensive, but get you some. Um, and then I have my MAC Fix Plus. This is a makeup lifesaver. My razor for my eyebrows. This is an oil from Lancome for your lips. Disposable mascara ones because I do other people's makeup. And then all my other eyeliners. So colored over here and then black over here. So the first drawer of my makeup container drawers that are from Home, not Home Depot, Office Depot by the way, has jewelry in it and I'm not going to go in it. So the next drawer is all my face makeup. Keep in mind, I do not wear like foundation and like concealer. I wear concealer on my like eyebrows and stuff, but I do not like put this stuff like full face makeup I don't I don't do that but I do do other people's makeup quite often so that's why I have this stuff so the drawer I do go in every day however is my highlight drawer these little things are from family dollar believe it or not so over here I have my full size highlighters which are my favorite MAC double gleam champagne pop this is Mary luminizer and then this top this wet and wild one crown my canopy it's pretty pretty awesome pretty dope <laughs> I have a NYX like blush that is super duper reflectant, so I use it as a highlight. Opal by Becca in the mini version. And then like I have some, if I say light one more time. And then I have some liquid highlights because those are bomb. And then like these bare minerals. Yeah, I know I said like again. Here I have my face powders. I don't have a lot of face powders because I'm super oily and I usually, I mean, because I'm super dry but super oily and usually don't use them. So here I have MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Natural in the super duper old packaging. My favorite face powder ever. This is so bomb.com. I did a review on this. I love it so freaking much. I'm almost hitting pan. I'm going to get my right color when I hit pan. But this is the Clean Matte Purse Powder. I love it so much. And then this is my favorite thing to bake with. This is the Maybelline Shine Free Powder. It's probably not the most ideal or the most like hyped up, but I love it to bake with because I just like it, you know. And then a Mary Kay powder. And then this is a Mary Kay primer that just sits there. And then here is blush. So Maybelline, Jordana, NYX. Bella Bomb, I have a MAC blush, it's way too light because Ladesha thought she knew what she was doing. Elf, and then Covergirl. 
And then the most exciting part of it, this drawer. Not really. But I have all my concealers back here. Pro Conceal are my favorite. So that's why I have so many colors. Oh, wait. This is actually my color. So, yeah. And that's something up. Like, the new Pro Conceal isn't as opaque as the old Pro Conceal. Like, this is a different concealer than this, believe it or not. I don't know if my Beauty Supply Store got, like, fake ones or whatever. But this is good. This ain't. And then I have Fit Me. This is really good, actually. The CoverGirl one is not that good. I just use it to lighten up foundations. The Dream Lumi is really good from Maybelline. Sunny Kashuk, I don't like that one. Some kind of gorgeous. This is a foundation, but it's so tiny, you know? And then another one from Pure Cosmetics or something like that. And then right here, I have some foundations. So I have the CoverGirl Clean Matte bb cream which is an awesome bb cream the covergirl ready set gorgeous which is an awesome foundation i really enjoy covergirl's products y'all not even trying to be like fake and then these are some awesome foundations these are the best foundations i have found from the drugstore even better than my covergirl ones yes these are the maybelline uh like square ones because they it's two names this is the fit me matte poison this is the fit me dewy smooth but the fit me foundations overall are awesome um i just have two colors because these are pretty much in between the colors that i use for clients and then i have bb cream sunscreen primers all under there yeah girl that's the first drawer next drawer is my lip gloss 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 right here i have all my chapsticks and squeeze tube lip glosses because i don't have too many squeeze tubes you know just a couple here and there as well as like carmex and vaseline how many carmex have you seen throughout this thing like let me know because i probably have a lot eos this is the owl bought it for decoration and then all my baby lips i take pride in my baby lips i love these they're not okay they're moisturizing but they after they get done moisturizing i don't know they have that after moisturization i don't know but yeah i love my baby lips and then i have a brush roll here as well as this these are my lip glosses or you know it's about color of course so it goes from light to dark i mostly go towards like the middle where like the mauves are <laughs> but they're from light to dark and then the back is just lipsticks that i don't use the next drawer is my lipstick drawer. So I have more lip glosses here that just were odd balls and I need to use these up because they're all like steel twist up glosses that are so out of style now. I have some lipsticks from the drugstore right here as well as a Benetint. Um, most of these are drugstore I think. Yeah. Love these Maybelline lipsticks. They're awesome. That's why they're on top. I have some like mini lipsticks here and these two liquid lipsticks that suck so much. And then my lip liners here. My favorite lip liners are these ones right here. Okay, I can't even get them out. So my favorite lip liners are these ones that I went in wild. They're so creamy and last so long on the lips. I just love them and you should get them. My favorite one, Bear to Comment. And the last is some lip crayons and lip pencils by Colourpop and all that kind of stuff. All back here. And lip balms. In the pots. Next drawer. Lip Galore. My favorite lip drawer. LOL that run. So back here are my favorite lip glosses that are not MAC. So these are all my NYX glosses and my baby lips glosses. I love those and then all my lip lipsticks right here i have three of the clean color matte matte lip glosses i have two of the color pop trash lip old really old like formula lipsticks and then i have two of the ruby kisses liquid lipsticks just like the Kylie general ones i have this wet and wild cushion lip thing that tried to be like the two face ones and then, of course, I have all my Too Faced ones and my NYX lip lingerie. And then here is my favorite. So this is all my MAC lip stuff. So I have my MAC Pat and Polish, my MAC Cream Sheen Glass, my MAC Dazzle Glasses. All my MAC lip glasses are all through here. 
and like the little ones are some cream sheen glasses too but most of these almost all of these are lip glasses and then I have another like little set right here and then these are some really tiny MAC perfume samples and these smell so good this is cream de nude and the other one's candy yum yum the next to the last drawer of houses, my eyeshadows and bronzers. Because I don't really wear bronzer like that. My favorite bronzer is Chocolate Soleil, and I got it in the palette up there. So, yeah. Bronzers, bronzers, I don't wear them. Um, this, I'm trying to look for this. It's discontinued, but I'm looking on Amazon for it because I really love this powder. And then another e.l.f. bronzer. Here is all my primers and bases. It's like the same from the old thing. And then I have a gel liner because why not? And then all of these are eyeshadows. It goes all the way back, people. Not even gonna discuss why I have all these eyeshadows and I probably don't even use them. But yeah, boo. And then the last one is palettes that I don't use as much or rarely use these are the palettes that i let other people use when they come over and they want to do makeup because these i don't care too much for i can still care about now you could go throw my palettes around but these are yeah you know you know the deal yeah and i normally get questions about this this is a perfume pillow from victoria's secret you just rub it on yourself and you get smell good okay why you won't draw? Why you won't draw close? Why you won't draw close? And then the last drawer that has makeup related stuff in it, it just has a lot of packaging, so I can do a lot of reviews. That is my whole entire makeup collection. So that is my makeup collection. I hope you guys enjoy. And if you did, don't forget to give a huge thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more of me or Nicki Minaj, cause of course she always in a cut. But uh, yeah, talk to y'all later. Bye. Don't you know that you the sh got me turning off my cell phone? Nothing's more important.